perhaps before we get into the uh, discussion with the city attorney about the legal settlement, I can make a brief statement. Um, you may recall when I came before you on August 17th of this year for confirmation to this commission, I was here um, because of my uh, past public service experience and because I am extremely dedicated to the mission of HACLA and to serving the needs of the families that HACLA works with. I remain committed to that mission today um, and at the time that I was appointed had been asked by the mayor and uh, remain committed to being a transformer of this agency uh, which is in serious need of transparency and accountability. The recent revelations of past agency expenditures and the discussion that has been had here today make it clear that there's a need for immediate and uh, dramatic reform. The Housing Authority and um, those of us who you empower to lead it have a very special obligation to use every taxpayer dollar in the most efficient, effective, and lawful manner possible. That means that every dollar should be spent in the best interests of the families that we serve, period. The Housing Authority provides a final safety net for these families who are in need of affordable housing, and lavish spending on personal needs is totally unacceptable under any circumstances. We're putting a stop to it now. Later today, I will recommend to the board that it appoint Los Angeles Housing Department General Manager Doug Guthrie to serve as our interim CEO. I have the highest respect for Mr. Guthrie. He's been involved in uh, public housing for decades. He was asked by the uh, mayor of Chicago many years ago to come in to help the Chicago Housing Authority turn around, and we will work together to take all necessary measures to reform the Housing Authority should the commission approve his appointment later today. These measures will include specifically working with the city controller on an expanded top-to-bottom audit of the authority's spending practices, which will include an analysis of the various agencies that are affiliated with the Housing Authority that were discussed earlier today, a top-to-bottom review of policies and personnel at the agency, implementation of systemic controls over travel, meals, and the use of agency P cards, as well as all other expenses, and finally, a review of the agency's code of ethics and the implementation of new provisions to strengthen it. I, for one, believe that the Board of Commissioners should be under control uh, and jurisdiction of the City Ethics Commission. Um, I also believe that we should eliminate all staff and commissioner travel and in-town meal expenses, as well as other types of discretionary spending, unless there is a showing of absolute urgent business need to serve the objectives of the authority and the families that we represent. The authority also should dramatically curtail or eliminate P cards for staff and commissioners. A number of city agencies have uh, policies and practices that we should examine and adopt. Um, regarding the audit, I have already directed the staff to confirm